Cause it just gets... All right, we got Lucy, Lucy A. She has a Christmas yeah. album. Oh, really? Oh, coming out now. Doesn't surprise Maybe me for her Barney's. Uh, <laughs> yeah, you know, why not, right? I like, I like Santa uh, fetish. Yeah. That right. was pretty right. hot. That was kind of sexy. Yeah. Especially when you wanted to take Santa to go and celebrate Hanukkah. They're like this. That's a. I love that, though. Like and I love how this year they overlap. <laughs> I think they should overlap every year. I think it's best when the holidays all work oh, like together. Like Easter and Passover? Yeah, yeah, let them all go together, <laughs> man. You know? I mean, interracial is the next black, isn't it? I mean, it's all freaking mixed. And Festivus. Why can't the world just be one Festivus. big New York City? I love Festivus. Yeah. Festivus for the yeah, rest of us. Exactly. Yeah. I know. It's just I don't know. I'm in. The, I I just think the whole world is like this, and then I'm always so you know what? taken by surprise it's, when it's, it's not. If big greedy oh. corporations can merge and make these big conglomerates, why can't the holidays? Why can't just something something in celebration? I feel like there are a lot something. of phrases in, in this last like five minutes. Yeah. Maybe on a T-shirt somewhere. <laughs> oh. If the big corporation conglomerates can do. What's on your T-shirt? Oh, right. So, you know, the Go Girls Music Fest yes. tomorrow here will be Which is December 1st, Thursday night. Right. Go Girls Music Fest. We love you, Madeline. The head Go Girl. Because chicks rock. Chicks Wait. rock. Guys rock, too. But, you know. We rock like, harder. 
Uh, so oh, no. I think it's, it's the same wave of, 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 of okay, all equal. of it mixing. But, you know, the guys had a lot more years ahead of us, and now the girls are just catching up to being as cool as the guys. Oh, awesome. <laughs> you got our support. Exactly. That's right. always nice. So, support is nice. Well, and we are doing support, it. Yeah. So we're, we're benefiting the Red Thread movement, which is a, a movement that started by students who are trying to abolish slavery in the South. So um, this was um, to believe that slavery is even exactly. still well, existing in the year 2011. Know, exactly, it's a lot of human trafficking stories going on, and, and it's sex just like slaving you're yeah, talking sex, about. And it's sexual not illegal. Slavery. No, no. What to, to sell these women out to other countries to be sex slaves? Is that what's not illegal? It, it should be not. illegal. It sounds like a law and order to me. A law and order, like a TV show? Yeah. This yeah. episode just it, about that? Yeah. Uh, about the girls. It should being, do that. Maybe that'll bring more, more uh, awareness, right? It, yeah. Yeah. So the girls are being trafficked out of Nepal into other countries to be sex slaves. Is that it? It's it's pretty terrible, yeah. So, but what the what uh, they're doing now, so they, they make these lovely bracelets. And who is they? Um, the girls themselves. They start so to raise money. And um, so no. they're they're doing this themselves. We're gonna have these for sale. For sale. How much are they? Uh, these are three dollars. So I can get one tomorrow night. Totally. I'm I'm getting one for sure. And it's really cool. I, I like so that. Three dollar contribution. You get yeah. a bracelet to help a girl. Like how do you help them? Like where are they making these inside trunks while they're being well, shipped yeah. out? Like I, I, I have to I have to yeah, seek some more detail. Right. I, I want to yeah. know. Like, but uh, I know like there there are three things. They're educating them and they're uh, now who's know, they. So, like, these students who started this initiative, started this movement. Are they this. in so, Nepal, too? I don't know if they're physically in Nepal. You know, that's a really good question. Like, I want to know where sure these girls come from stops, that are right? helping the girls that are in trouble. I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm very gullible, but I'm also skeptic about certain things as well, especially yeah. when the dollar is concerned. Yeah, Only yeah, yeah. because... You want to make sure it's going to the right place. I agree with that. Totally. I mean, I, I don't want to sound like skeptic. I mean, I want to buy a bracelet for sure, but I want to know, like, who's in touch with these girls and where are these girls? Are they freed from slavery now or are they in slavery now? Like, how do you communicate with the ones that are slaves? I'm, I, this is my dot, dot, dot face. I'm like, I'll have to get back to you, Ruth. I know. <laughs> well, I'm sorry to be so question minded, but, but no, you know, it's good. It's good to ask questions because this is how how we get informed, right? Yeah, that's so how we like, get involved with stuff. Exactly. So questions. like, and and that was probably that's probably how it all started in, to begin with, where these students and and the school were just like, you know, what the heck, really? This is what goes on, and then they probably started investigating some more, and they're like, we got to do something, and so slowly, you know, everybody. Everybody so, does a little something to contribute. Now, these so, students have like a link and, and that sort of thing? Yeah, you can go to uh, redthreadmovement.org. That's why it's Red Thread. I yeah. love that bracelet. Yeah, it's no, it's cool. a wonderful cause, and I feel lucky to be a part of it. But, you know, once at Otto's also, we, we did another thing to help women in third world countries where they're not allowed to have feminine... Hygiene products? Yes, hygiene products. And so oh. because of that, oh. they're not allowed to go to school. They're not allowed to work. So they were. we were making here these oh, products that came out so cool to ship to these countries mm. because other women students or whatever are organizing. Women are not treated properly throughout the world. We take it so for granted. Yeah. Yeah, and I mean, that's why like, Go Girls is so cool. <laughs> We're really lucky to be yeah. here. And I think about that a lot, actually. I'm like, oh, what, what's really lucky to be what's in said status quo or policy or, or the law, you know, doesn't, you know, it goes against uh, equality in, in a lot of aspects. It, it's so true. It's, it's bizarre that it still continues. It makes me think of Gone with the Wind. Um, how when the women were all knitting and the men were out supposedly doing what they do and and it just shows how the women I think yeah and I just think the women are supposed to sit there and and do their little knitting and needlepoint but their conversations are extremely intelligent like it just shows that women are not are pushed away but they're not stupid <laughs> Well, yeah, <laughs> yeah. I mean, we've come, we've definitely come a long way. So, yeah. like, if you see like women running corporations, and yeah, like, that a, now it doesn't like, seem like we're not. You could never get enough Eleanor Roosevelts in the world, for example. Is that what it is? I 
guess so. It just blows my mind that the world is still so like that. It's a little slow. Now, do you think that these people, all right, you will show that. Um, do you think that these people, though, even the ones that are being slave trafficked and do um, you think they're online and have internet access? Because it seems like wow. no matter what right I now. I doubt that. But I suppose I you, you never know. Them, you know what I mean? And, and there was one village. I'm really surprised right now how no matter how behind a third world country is, they're on freaking Facebook. It's right, so right. bizarre. Like some countries now have stopped YouTube and stopped Facebook in their countries because the people have been getting access to communicate with the, the outside world. world. Uh, yeah, that's crazy. Yeah, and there, there was one article I read a long time ago about a, a small village in Africa, I cannot remember the, exactly where, but where they had a, they had, oh, that's the, that's the CD, it's going to be given out for free, ah, um, you know, as a thank you for your donation. For the Go Girls. That's yeah. Cool. Are you on this one? Yes, I am. Which song? That song that I that you just sang is on yeah. it? Oh, that's yeah. beautiful. Yeah, so congratulations. Nice it's uh, it's really cool. So um, yeah. So everyone who comes in, it's a five dollar donation admission to come in. Suggested donation. And how many people are performing? And uh, we got seven wonderful Go Girls, including Miss Rue right here. Yeah, it's gonna be a fun show. And Amazing Amy is gonna be dancing with my act. You're a contortionist. She's a contortionist. I'm so excited. Uh, she about danced that. with oh me God. like uh, a week or so ago. That sounds amazing. And and it was crazy. She's she's wild. That's really cool. Mm. She'll probably dance with anyone. I mean, really? she loves to do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you going to dance with her? Like, no, well, I'm going to sing my songs and just right. do my thing. And I know, gonna man. Next thing you thing. know, Rue's going to be like pretzel. Oh, I don't know about that, but you can if you want. But you go on at what time? Uh, I go on at 7.30. Oh, so you're first? Yeah, I'm uh, second. Rachel oh, okay. Rachel Lee Walsh goes on first. Seven. And then... Um, I go on 7.30ish or so, Okay. and uh, we got more people, we got Inky Glass. Inky Glass is going to be on today at yeah. 5.45 later on. And uh, we awesome. got Melissa Clark, we got Lashi and Meridian Gold. Nice. And uh, we got someone coming out from Washington, D.C. Teak. Yeah. I love Teak. Teak. Yeah, Teak's she's, awesome. She's so badass, so I'm, I'm really excited. She came to the Go Girls that. Music Fest last year. Oh, really? She did, and that was at the Brandon Salon, our other lovely venue. So but cool. um, yeah, so all right, so tomorrow I know you're playing. Where else are you playing after that? Uh, that's going to be the last show actually for the year. Okay. And um, then after, uh, I might be coming back here, I believe, in uh, January. Nice. Yeah. And, and what's you your website? How do people find your beautiful voice? It's uh, luciara.com. That's L U C I A R.com. Nice. And there you could. Check out my music. You could look at the schedule, see where I'm going. I'm planning a tour for March, so ah, you know, where? I'll check up again. Just uh, Midwest and over. So Good I'm going to start you. there and work it over. I, I've never scheduled a tour before, so this is going to be really interesting. Good for you. <laughs> oh, it's so much <laughs> fun. Cool. So um, it is National Moose Day, That's and I don't want right. to deprive you from your from your moose treat. So I mean, do you have a skeleton you that you want to share? Oh, um, this is this is a little lame, but I'm. I'm not eating um, gluten oh, right oh, now. Oh, you can lick it off the top. Uh -huh. Is that all right? Sure. That, that, do you want to we'll still take the skeleton off. Do you want your finger? Oh. Oh. Ah! It's all right. There you go. down. Moose down. Um, all right, all right. Um, you know how Ma Mama says don't talk to strangers. Well, I did. Okay. A lot of strangers. Out when I was in Paris by myself. Okay. And it was nice. You did a lot I, of strangers. I, I, I didn't do a lot of strangers. Uh, did a lot of strangers. Especially in Paris. I mean, it's kind of like inevitable. I spoke to strangers. And let me tell you, they were so great. Like, I got led by the arm, like, across town. Like, they were just showing me all these wonderful things. They were like, all right, you know, I got something to do now, so hope you have a great rest of the stay. Then I need somebody else, and they'd take me around. And and, it was, a a continuation really cool. of the tour. Yeah. So, so, so basically, you toured Paris by talking to strangers when you were told not to. Good for you. Nice. Will you have some of this? Ah, yeah. There you go. There's chocolate blues for you. On our on my screen. hand. There you go. Ooh, I like it. I like it. This is messy. Good. We like that. So Thank you. Oh, oh gosh. I love when you visit. I I love how you sing, and I look forward to tomorrow night. Thanks, babe. Me time too. Here. I think it's gonna be really awesome. Go yeah. girls. We love yeah. go girls. Yes, we do. Because Chicks Rock see you here at Auto 7 p.m. December 1st. Yeah, okay. it's December. <laughs> we'll be back. Thanks for having me. Yeah, I know.